Hey, hello everyone. This is Sham Jaitani, human interior designer and life detoxifier. Live once again, and I'm back with your daily self development activity, which is called your accountable partner. It is truly my wish from the bottommost bottom of my heart that every single person out there lives a must great life. And if you're not living a must great life, then in that case, what are you doing with your life? I don't know. Ask yourself, and if you don't get an answer, reach out to me. I'll help you understand what it is, okay? So, today's quote of the day. Uh, I'm, first of all, I'm really sorry for being late. I'm, I'm late by almost, I think, 15, 20 minutes. So, uh, the, today's quote of the day is, uh, you know, let's make each other's experience of life beautiful. I repeat that. So, the, so today's quote of the day is, let's make each other's experience of life beautiful. Now, if you ask me how is that you can do it, there are so many ways how you can you know, make each other's experience of life beautiful. Even if you're making your experience of life beautiful, trust me, in some or the other way, you're actually making someone's experience of life beautiful. Because when you are making your life, you are happy. When you are happy, that is when you can make others happy. That is when you will have the power and the energy to make someone else happy or everyone else happy. So, you know, probably one of the things that you can do is that, you know, there were so many quotes that I have come up with from the last couple of days. You can pick up any one of those quotes and implement that today in your life. And trust me, as I said, you will not just make your experience of life beautiful, you will end up making everyone's experience of life beautiful. Because if you are happy, I will repeat that, because if you are happy, you will have the energy, you will have the power to make everyone else happy. You know, you can do so many things, you know. Probably, you know, you can, when you go to your workplace, probably you can buy some chocolates for your, you know, your colleagues at your workplace, and you distribute them. You know, you can probably, you know, buy chocolates or maybe something for, you know, people at your home, you know, your family members, and you know, and make them happy. If you are in a situation that you cannot buy, if you're financially down, and if you cannot buy anything for anyone, then that is absolutely fine. Because I have been through that situation in my life so, so, so many times, yeah? So what, what you can do is that at least, at least, at least, at least you can make, you know, someone smile and laugh, you know, probably by cracking a joke, or even at least by smiling at someone, you know, who has never been expecting that you would, you would smile. You know, do something unexpected. Do something that will shock you. You know, make yourself feel blessed today. Make someone feel blessed today. Uh, because, you know, make, make moments. Because, you know, this is what you will cherish for your entire lifetime. You would not be cherishing what all things that you bought. I'm telling you, I'm telling you this right now, that you will not be cherishing the things that you have bought in, a, in your life, but then you will definitely cherish what you have given. Because when you give, trust me, you know, what the happiness and the joy that you get while giving, it is something which is uncomparable with anything. Anything, even if you buy maybe, you know, a 10 crore property, supposedly, okay, I'm telling you, even then you will not get that much amount of joy while, you know, you give the simplest of the simplest thing to someone. If you if you can bring someone, if you can, you know, make someone smile, if you can make someone happy, if you can make someone feel blessed today, that will give you more happiness than buying that 10 crore property. Let me tell you that. Make someone feel motivated today. Make some, you know, inspire someone. As I said, make someone feel blessed today. Yes. Go ahead and do that. You know, uh, you know why I do all these things is that let me let me give you a gist of uh, let me give you an idea of why I do all these things. Okay, uh, you know when when you will be when you will grow old when you will be sitting down on your chair you know you'll be kind of lying down you you'll be resting your head your legs would be you know on a very, very relaxed mode. Every single person out there, okay, whether that is a man or a woman, okay. You will still get tears in your eyes. Now, what kind of tears do you want is the question. Ask yourself this question. What kind of tears do you want when you will be resting on that chair? Do you want tears 
of happiness, joy, or do you want tears of regrets? You know, I'm damn sure that every single person over there on that chair is going to get, is, is going to cry. You know, their eyes will definitely get wet with the tears. But then what kind of tears do you want? Do you want tears of regrets or do you want tears of happiness, joy? And you know, immense love and experiences, beautiful experiences and you know, so many moments that you will be cherishing on that chair. So ask this question to yourself, what kind of tears do you want in your life? So that is the activity of the day today. I, I am not giving you any example because I want to hear you know, experiences and examples from you. What you have experienced today, how did you implement these kind of things today and what was your experience. So that's all that I want to say for now. Thank you so much for joining everyone. You don't have a good day because you got to make one, okay? Samba set and Geo, full power. <laughs>